So, I don't get it, Matt. Lean and testing are different. How are they related? Yeah, totally different. Um, so, testing is testing. It's always going to be testing. Testing is how we do our work. Uh, lean is methods to measure and manage that work. So when I come into a typical organization, uh, when we work together, a lot of the new ideas are, here's more work to do, here's more things for you to test, which it, it, you might not do them, or if you do them, you pretty much can't let go of the old stuff. So now you're doing more work, which slows you down. Uh, lean is actually a way to measure and manage and look at the flow of the work. And once we see that flow, we can find the waste in the work, suck it out, improve the flow. So we're still doing the same testing, we're doing it faster because of these methods to measure. Mm -hmm. Right? Does that make sense? Yeah, it does. So they are different and that's, that's, that's okay. Um, so I think we're good then. Yeah. Then we can start the video whenever you want to turn it on. A minute? Go. What do you mean a minute? Is it right now? Oh. Oh, hi everybody. Hi. I'm Matt Witcher. Um, I'm going to be in, uh, this, is, this is Abby Buell, Buell, one of our uh, customers at Exelon Development. And we're in South Bend, Indiana, home of the Notre Dame Fighting Irish, if you're familiar with the Fighting, Fighting Irish. If you're in Europe, maybe not. But they're, they're, they're a um, popular American uh, football team in college. And I'm going to be in Europe soon, in November, in Potsdam, Germany, for Agile Testing Days 2014. We're going to be doing the Software Testing World Cup and also a tutorial on uh, uh, Lean Software Testing Half Day, which is what we've been talking about. Mm -hmm. So, so what, are, what are you actually going to teach? What are you going to do? Right, so we, uh, we're going to run exercises to simulate a real software project. You've got uh, conditions of uncertainty, you've got time pressure, you've got a little bit of confusion. And so it's just like a real software project, only it's super accelerated. So you could go through an, an iteration or a sprint in 15 minutes, and you can watch what happens during that time period. Right. Then we introduce some theory, give a little theory about different sources of waste and where it comes from, and flow, which is the, the way the work works. Um, if you think of a, a developer and a tester working together, and the story only takes eight hours start to finish. But they're all working on different things and they're multitasking and, and there's lots of wait states. Somehow it ends up taking two weeks. We identify and measure that. We can map it. We've got some ways to graph it. And when you suck the waste out and you reduce the multitasking, performance goes through the roof. And you've got ways to measure and predict it. That's the lean part. So mm -hmm. we teach in a theory combined with exercises to help people see the value. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. Great. That sounds very hands-on. So what will, what will somebody take away from this tutorial? What will they be able to go practice? It can, it can be very tough because it's very context sensitive. It's based on your organization. So the first thing you're going to learn is tools to analyze your organization and find the waste. And usually that waste is things that are not mandated that anyone do. They're, they're actual literal, like I have to walk this piece of paper across the corporate office to give it to someone else. Or um, uh, uh, even emailing it is okay, fine, but then it sits on someone's desk for two weeks, and that two weeks incurs weight. So how can we eliminate it? So you're going to come up with all these ideas for improvement. Don't have to change the test process, any, we just have to remove the waste. Um, and so that will allow you to see, it's almost like seeing in a different dimension. Because usually we don't visualize things like cycle time, how long something takes to flow. And doing that for a test is particularly hard because tests are not equal and measuring test cases is dangerous. So we're going to come up with some metrics that actually stand up to scrutiny to how to measure the test process. Mm -hmm. Sounds great. Very interesting. All right. Well, thanks for that, Matt. Is there anything else I can do? Anything else you want to talk about? Um, you can sing, sing your little jingle. Yeah, well, that's uh, so. Excellent Development has a jingle, but I only do it on person and site on site visits. So, <laughs> if you want to hear it, you're going to have to hear it in uh, Possum, Germany, in November. See you there.